Hey guys, so I know I ended Vlogmas. This is not an official Vlogmas video, <laughs> but I wanted to pick up the camera and vlog today. Um, it is a half day for the kids at school, so they went to school in their pajamas because it was also pajama day. Um, this weekend, oh my gosh, you guys, this weekend I am going to be socially drained. I don't know if you guys get this way, but... I am a huge introvert. I deal with social anxiety. I don't do well putting myself in situations that I'm not familiar with. <laughs> so tomorrow morning I get to take Ethan to his first basketball practice, surrounded by people I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's just an hour, so I can do that. I, I can survive. I don't get to sleep in though, which kind of stinks. I'm giving up my, my sleep in time, but it's okay. Um, then I got to bring him home, get him showered, and changed into something decent because we are invited to a Christmas party um, at one of his friend's house. And uh, I'm going to be surrounded by a bunch of people I don't know. <laughs> Um, so like, I'm like really stressing about that because Aaron's not coming with me. It's just going to be me and the boys. He has to work, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, I just, I feel like when I'm in situations like this, I, for some reason, cannot think of a conversation to have with somebody I don't know. Um, my, my, my brain, <laughs> my brain completely blanks on me. I sometimes will zone out and go in into my own head and like not even realize where I am. I don't know if it's a coping mechanism or what that is, but a lot of the times like I'll just go into myself and, you know, not even pay attention. And some people have to be like, Sasha, hey, Sasha. And I'm like, oh, yeah, what? <laughs> so I just become like this awkward uh, and it takes a lot for me to stay in the moment so I'm gonna have to like really force myself not to like go into myself in my social anxiety state and um, not be awkward so that's gonna be fun uh, how I make friends I don't know but I, I managed to do it I'm gonna get the kids from school here in probably about 30 minutes um, then I'm gonna bring them home get them changed out of their pajamas um, and then uh, feed them some lunch and we're gonna go pick out Something for them to spend their money on that their Gigi sent them for Christmas and their Pepe. And then uh, we got to pick out a hostess gift for this party too. <laughs> so I didn't vlog while we were out. Um, I obviously have got the kids now. We've had lunch. We went to the store. But I want to show you what they pick out when I don't guide them at all. I let them pick out everything. We walked around the store several times until they were satisfied. So I want to show you with what unsolicited my kids spent their $25 on. So this big giant thing, this big giant pillow is Seth. They were only $5. Camera died on me. Um, this <laughs> is a make your own power bouncy ball kit. And then this was over in like arts and crafts guys. So if you have anybody in your household that would like these, it is a tin can robot. So we have, and he has to back. yep. We have a whole bunch of cans that we are going to take to recycling. Um, that we just haven't crushed yet on the back porch. So he just got to pick whatever can he wanted from the back porch. But yeah, they've got, they got the circuit boards and everything there. All that stuff. My oldest, he picked out a new pillow. Oh, and then we picked out <laughs> He wanted this one. Too. Yeah, but that was for getting good grades. That was your treat for getting good grades. And then he picked out, he likes these monster trucks. Yeah. Which kind of surprised me that he grabbed a monster truck. And another pair of headphones. We just bought him a headphones. He got some for his Christmas or birthday money in October. And he grabbed another pair. So headphones is probably a good stock stock up item for you. This Coca-Cola can was brand new. Yeah, did you rinse it clean? Yeah. Okay. And then we went to like the Christmas area and we got like a really small just kind of like gift that I could give somebody. It's just basically cake mix in a jar. Um, uh, like this, it's already sealed, so I don't have to worry about it. Um, but I didn't want to get anything too big, you know what I mean? So we just did 
chocolate chip cookie mix in a jar. So that's going to be our thanks for inviting us gift. You guys, this was a nightmare. I'm not going to lie to you. It is so many little I'm pieces. I'm still looking at the other eye. Yeah, we're trying to get the other eye on. But anyway, this says it's for eight, over eight years old. So <laughs> Seth is seven. Um, he could not have done this by himself. I am in my 30s, and I was over here having a moment, okay? <laughs> she was breaking down. <laughs> yes, I was. Um, yeah. This is uh, your adult supervision. The th screws are tiny. They're finicky. And the bad boy on. Let's see if it works. Okay, I'm going to Dun, dun, something. dun. Moment yes! of truth. Turn it off. Oh, oh. Going oh, okay. Well, the eyeballs are supposed to stay up then. So there's two different ways that this thing crawls. It just depends how you want to do it. <laughs> it's going. But it works. You just oh. have to have a lot, a lot of patience for this, guys. Like, ah. oh, a lot of patience. But anyway, he'll have fun with that. There you go. You're welcome. So in all honesty, guys, that toy is probably going to be one that he plays with quite often. Um, I'm just warning you that the setup process is a nightmare um i think that took us about an hour to put together and that's not even an exaggeration uh it's just the pieces are so <laughs> tiny hey, and i have really small hands world. so <laughs> trying to put the screws in was was the issue um hey, otherwise it's world. fine so if you have the patience for those little itty bitty baby tiny screws that you need like almost a um eyeglass screwdriver then go for it. But if you don't have the patience for that, maybe not do that one. Um, but yeah, that's the kind of stuff my kids like. <laughs> I'm picking on the kids. I told them I was gonna go take them to basketball practice like this tomorrow and they're both like, no! Um, anyway, I got a new sweater in. It's a men's medium and it fits comfortably. So I get a men's medium or a ladies large for like the looser, longer fit. Um, and I got myself some new sweatpants because I was in need of some, and I got red slippers. <laughs> red slippers. Old Navy, guys. This whole thing's from Old Navy. I'm just going to relax today, guys, because I have to get up hey. early no, 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 no. tomorrow morning. Because of basketball practice. Yeah, we got early practice for brother, and then the party, like I said um, earlier. So I'm going to try to get some dishes done here in a little bit. Got my laundry done, so that's good. Um, and I'm in my robot. Just have to me. do, yeah. Your your robot sweeping with a paintbrush. Um. Anyway, I just have to do the dishes, cook dinner, and clean up the kitchen before bed. Well, so, my robot has already cleaned. I up think once I get through now. tomorrow, I will feel better. My robot has oh man, I don't know how long this one is. It's probably a short one, but I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here um i am like itching my eyes and i feel like i might be getting the cold that aaron had which i hate <laughs> um but unfortunately you know whenever he gets something it's most likely that i i will get it too uh so yeah that's fun especially because i have a busy weekend but i'll push through i'll get through it all will be fine um so yeah I am going to end this. I will see you guys when I see you. Bye.